Hey there, fellow book enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the gripping world of Fyodor Dostoevsky's masterpiece, Crime and Punishment. Get ready to unravel the complexities of this timeless classic as we explore its rich themes and unforgettable characters. First up, let's set the stage with an introduction to Crime and Punishment. Picture the gritty streets of 19th century St. Petersburg, Russia, where poverty and desperation lurk around every corner. It's a world where morality is murky and the line between right and wrong is often blurred. Enter our protagonist, Raskolnikov. He's a brooding, enigmatic young man whose mind is consumed by existential questions and philosophical debates. But beneath his intellectual facade lies a troubled soul, haunted by his own inner demons. The murder of the pawnbroker is the catalyst for Raskolnikov's descent into darkness. Driven by a twisted sense of logic and a desire to prove his own superiority, he commits the crime with chilling precision. But as the aftermath unfolds, Raskolnikov finds himself grappling with overwhelming guilt and remorse. Enter Sonia, a young woman whose unwavering faith and compassion serve as a beacon of light in Raskolnikov's dark world. Their interactions are fraught with tension and longing as Raskolnikov struggles to reconcile his own moral ambiguity with Sonia's steadfast goodness. But Raskolnikov's family and friends also play a crucial role in his journey. From his loyal friend Razumikin to his enigmatic sister Dunya, each character brings a unique perspective to the unfolding drama, shaping Raskolnikov's path in unexpected ways. Meanwhile, the investigation by the police tightens its grip around Raskolnikov, closing in on the truth of his crime. As the walls close in, Raskolnikov's internal struggle reaches a fever pitch, and he's forced to confront the consequences of his actions head-on. But amidst the darkness, there's a glimmer of hope. Raskolnikov's desire for redemption burns bright as he grapples with questions of morality, justice, and the nature of sin. Can he find salvation in a world consumed by corruption and despair? Throughout the novel, religious and philosophical ideas weave through the narrative, adding layers of depth and complexity to Raskolnikov's existential crisis. From the teachings of Christianity to the existentialist philosophy of nihilism, each belief system offers a different lens through which to view the human condition. And as we reach the conclusion, we're left with a haunting question. What fate awaits Raskolnikov? Will he find redemption and peace, or is he doomed to a life of eternal torment? It's a conclusion that will leave you breathless, pondering the depths of the human soul long after you turn the final page. So there you have it, Folks, a journey into the heart of crime and punishment. It's a novel that challenges our understanding of morality, justice, and the nature of humanity, leaving an indelible mark on the literary landscape for generations to come.